What's up, everybody? OCD Bussin here today, and welcome to Fern Bus Coach Simulator. Yeah, buddy, uh, this is a kind of new uh, bus simulator, uh, at least for consoles. Um, so yeah, very nice game. It's a very different than uh, it's very different than Bus Simulator 21. Um, so yeah, uh, there is a bunch of DLCs for this game that are like 30 bucks each, but I don't think I'm going to be getting them just yet. We'll see how I like the game. I've just started, so yeah. Um, but yeah, um, so yeah, we're going to do a big giant uh, route. Um, but first, I'm going to show you all the buses. Uh, so we got, we're going to be using this uh, Man Lions Coach second gen. Um, there's also a bunch of other gens uh, that you need DLCs for. Some of them we can use, like this one we can use. Um, and this one we can use, this one, and this one. I actually kind of like these square ones, but, um, we're going to start off with this bad boy, because I'm kind of used to it already, so, yeah. Um, and yeah, there is a bunch of other different buses, uh, we got a comfort class, and then we got a bunch of different ones for this. Nice. Uh, we got the Neo... Neopolin, Neoplan, Skyline, Skyliner, and there's only that one. Um, Futura, and you got a bunch of different ones that you need a DLC for. Um, this also, Scania, you need DLC. Uh, this one, you need DLC. <laughs> a lot of them you need DLCs for. Um, but yeah. Uh, there is also a bunch of other bu little kind of van buses. Um, uh, we're in Flix bus right now, and you can go over to Shuttle, and I'll just show you uh, this. You can also do Arcade or Realistic. I go Realistic because, yeah. Um, but, yeah, there's a, then a bunch of other buses in here, and like this one here, <laughs> or this one. This one we have, this one we need a DLC for, but, yeah. Uh, this one we need a DLC. We got a couple of man buses, but, yeah. Need DLCs for. So, yeah. Um, anyway, so, yeah, we're going to do this Flix bus, bus one, though, and I will show you here. We are, our, our garage or home base is in Amsterdam. And our route is basically every freaking little city that we have unlocked so far. So, yeah, it's basically every route. Uh, so it is going to take a while. Um, but you can save your progress, so you can keep on, uh, continue on with your, uh, your progress. So, yeah. Uh, there's also different modes. you got realistic and arcade. Uh, you can change the date to, uh, like, your actual date, which I do. Um, you can change the time to your actual date, which I'm not. Um, and you can change the weather uh, to whatever you like, but I'm keeping it as dynamic. So yeah, that is that. And without further ado, let's get right into it. But yeah, as you can see, we are in the world. And we are, I think we're in, uh, we're in Rotterdam, so. Um, but yeah, we'll uh, get on the bus and we'll uh, get going. And you actually have to like interact with everything. You can open up the luggages and the doors and everything. It's pretty cool. I like that a lot. Um, you can walk around and whatnot and do all that jazz. So yeah, uh, you can uh, change your mirrors. Um, right now I do have it on just because it's a little hard to see sometimes in the city so it helps a little um, but I might turn it off sometimes um, control settings so um, we have to hold uh, square for our door options and our bus options so there you go you see our doors closing um, we're driving so we're gonna lift it uh, we got a kitchen I guess um, Oh, we have to turn the bus on before we do this. So, let's uh, do that. Go all the way up. Make sure it's in neutral. Put it in drive. 
Uh, I don't need the lights on. It's pretty nice out. Uh, we'll turn the park and brake off. You can turn the windshield wipers on and off. Um, yeah, so this part you have to hold X. Sorry. So this is all holding X stuff. Um, you got lights, horns, uh, retarder. Uh, cruise control, which is not bad. Uh, air conditioning, which we will turn on, and we'll turn it down to around 20. All right, so that stuff is good. All the doors are closed. Everything is up, I think. Yep, turn this stuff on. Uh, this is the restroom clearance. I don't even know if we have one on this bus. I don't think we do, but whatever. Uh, passenger monitors, or we'll turn that on. Uh, we're gonna lock these luggage doors for now. We will turn our sign on. So we go to the na number 99 from Amsterdam to whatever. And then we have an announcement, which we will do um, when we get to, um, before we take off. Uh, reading lights will turn on and passenger compartment lights here will have those on too. So, all right, without further ado, we are ready to go. So let's uh, get to the uh, first destination. All right, where am I going here? Come on. I will say the mini-map is kind of small, so uh, yeah. And uh, there is no button to look, so I kind of have to do the old uh, look -aroo. Okay. I'm uh, gonna inch my way in here because these fuckers aren't gonna let me in I have a feeling. But it does, it turns with my, uh, see how it has like the dynamic turning there? Which is really nice. I will do, take that any day of the week. Uh, you also have to worry about fuel in this game. Um, as well as resting, uh, just like in On the Road, we have to rest. This dick is not gonna let me in, I don't think, but he is gonna have to. Alright, but I hope I made that turn. Alright, I think we get it a little bit over the bump, or the curb, or whatever, but we're good. And the camera resets itself, too, so if you ever need to look and not. As soon as you let go of the analog stick, it will straighten itself out eventually. Um, yeah, it's no speed limiter, uh, so we are gonna have to watch our uh, speed limit, but uh, it is there at the bottom right, uh, 50 kilometers, so we are in a 50 zone. Um, and you can see there we have 28 kilometers um, to go. And our arrival time is for 10 minutes from now, so at 10 o'clock. And I believe it also shows at the top, too. But I don't see it right now. I think it just does that once we start it. The horn. Not the greatest, but... And we can change our view. Bad. Blinkers work very well, actually. Gotta say, overall, it's a pretty good game. The traffic sometimes can be a little uh, slow, and they don't like to uh, advance sometimes, but uh, it is what it is. Like right here, we got a guy that's probably trying to turn left, and he's having trouble, I think. So hopefully he turned, and when this light changes, I can see the light from here. Uh, hopefully we can go. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Alright, come on, get going. And I am drive. it is a uh, wheel, driving wheel support, uh, you can use your driving wheel. Uh, I'm using the T80 Thrustmaster, just the crappiest of the crap. But it, it gets the job done, it honestly, it's, 
it's a little it's a little old but it freaking gets the job done I'm not gonna lie so I ain't complaining about this little this old thing all right we're finally at the front of the light here oh and the uh, uh, like the braking system you actually have to like kind of hold the brake to stop it's it's kind of realistic I like it I like it a lot Of course you're turning left. Alrighty, back on the road. 26k to go now. We've gotten a whole two kilometers down. Every time I make a video, the traffic sucks. Sick of this. The steering's pretty good too for my driving wheel, I will say. Could be a lot worse. this whoa well that's different I've never seen this before the freaking bridge is up we gotta wait for the bridge <laughs> just my luck I, I've never encountered anything like this before ever and then the minute I freaking <laughs> There it goes. That's cool. This is sick. Yeah, well, you gotta wait for the bridge to go down, bud. <laughs> Everyone's honking. Jesus. That's cool, I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna just turn that mirror on for now. I think we'll be good. Okay, let's go. Freaking cool. I don't think Bus Simulator 21 is that stuff. <laughs> Alright, and I do need to merge. So, sorry, I got in the truck there. And there is uh, damage, I believe, too, but I think you can repair as well. Speed limit is actually pretty good, or like not bad. Like if you're like a couple miles over the speed limit, you're not gonna get tagged for speeding. It's not a two you know. Okay, I was gonna merge in there. But that's just a turning lane. Now I can go. Okay, twelve more k. Alrighty, and we're just about coming up on our thing. We got like 2k left. passengers and we do actually have to check them in so it is a bit of a process just to actually get them on the bus um, so yeah I like to um, just put the parking brake on and then we will do a few things we will open the doors we will lower it 
Make sure all this stuff is on, and then we will unlock the luggage compartments. And I think that should be it. I think that's all we need to do. And then we actually have to open the luggage compartments. There's only one on this side. And then we got two over here. And now we can check them in. So we actually have to check them in and make sure they're good. Express check. so we're just about on time um, so yeah we'll get going here um, so yeah all right we'll turn the parking brake off um, and then everything else is good here we'll, we'll close our doors we'll raise our bus we will lock these back up and then we will start our nap. Okay, and I'm gonna go while the announcement's going. Usually you wait before, but uh, yeah. And it does say it in German first, and then it does it in English one, so it does take a while. Okay. <laughs> Eine Toilette befindet sich im hinteren Einstiegsbereich. Wer kostenlos surfen will, wählt sich einfach in unser WLAN-Netz ein. Unser Reisetipp fürs okay. Internet, schaut doch mal auf unserer Facebook-Page vorbei. Unser Team freut sich riesig über eure Likes und Nachrichten. Sollte euer Akku zu Neige gehen, kein Problem. Viele unserer Sitze sind mit Steckdosen ausgestattet und entsprechend gekennzeichnet. So könnt ihr euer Smartphone die gesamte Fahrt über nutzen. Wenn ihr eure nächste Fahrt auch gleich mobil buchen wollt, holt euch einfach unsere App und profitiert von exklusiven Online-Angeboten. Auf flixbus.de stehen täglich brandaktuell alle Infos und Städteverbindungen für euch bereit. Natürlich wollen wir unseren Service ständig weiter verbessern. Für Feedback zu eurer Fahrt nutzt bitte den Fragebogen, den wir euch per E-Mail zuschicken. Wir danken für eure Aufmerksamkeit und wünschen eine entspannte Fahrt und viel Spaß an Bord bei Flixbus. Hello and welcome. So we got 267k to go. And I think it's I think we're going to before we start off. Honestly, don't like to share some information. Could pull up my phone, but the wearing of seatbelts is compulsory on board the bus. Yeah, this is the phone, so uh, we're going to Lyle. Therefore, please keep your seatbelt fastened throughout the entire journey. 
in the seat pocket in front of you, you will find our information card containing further safety instructions and details of our snacks and beverages. There is a restroom located in the rear boarding area. If you would like to browse the internet free of charge, simply log on to our onboard Wi-Fi network. If your battery runs out, no problem. Many of our seats are equipped with power outlets, yeah, which are marked straight. If you would like to book your next journey, like that. Thank you. All right, we avoided that crap. So you can take advantage of our many exclusive online discounts. For more information, simply visit flixbus.com or get in touch and with I us on so Facebook. Good. Of course, we're always striving to improve our service. Ah, Please use I'm the questionnaire we send you by email to give us feedback about your journey. You can also use it to share your suggestions. I will say some of the merges are a bit we're sketchy. Ready to assist. Uh, but yes. not too bad if you uh, pay attention to your GPS. And enjoy traveling with Flixbus. Alright, I think we're just about to leave the 50 zone after this, uh, this turn here. I'm not mistaken. does get up to 100 pretty quick, I'm not gonna lie. It's pretty, it's pretty nice. Alright, I'm gonna try to merge here. Good, yeah, I can see them here. Alright, on the highway, finally! Yay! And once we get on the highway, honestly, the kilometers go down pretty quick. And, yeah, it's not too bad. I do like to try and stay in the fast lane as much as possible, but sometimes you need to uh, stay in the right lane and merge or off ramp or whatever. And I actually have to turn off your shit. We made it. <laughs> that's why I don't like going in the fast lane because, yeah, that's uh, the one problem with that. But sometimes you need to just because the traffic truck is going too slow and you just need to get the hell around them. When traffic's like this, this is when it's nice. It's just spaced out. Already down to 240. Which isn't bad. And like all the stops are like relatively close, so like the fact that it's still 240k, it's pretty crazy.
the signs are pretty uh, pretty nice. They're pretty clear to follow. I mean, I don't speak German, but I can read the signs all right. Driving physics are very good in this game, I'm not gonna lie. Way better than uh, the Sim 21. Pass these freaking guys. Some of the trucks do go very slow, I will say. But if you get one, it's not too bad. It's not too bad. Thank God we don't freaking take that. That would have sucked. See now, look at that van. He's speeding up. See? Now he's going faster than I am. He'll probably pass this truck once I pass him. Yeah, see, look at him break. All right, get going. Speed limit is 100, not 40. Another truck. Why are they so slow? Get going. 60 and 100. We do have a parking uh, thing up here. Actually, I'm probably going to take that. Uh, all right, let me just uh, merge. Hopefully, I didn't hit anybody. Hazel Newt. <coughs> oh, the hell is a Hazel Newt? Alrighty. So yeah, I think that's uh, about going to do it for today. Um, so yeah, tune in uh, next episode where we will be back here for episode two. Um, yeah, I, I'm liking this game. I'm not gonna lie. So yeah, hopefully we should be able to finish uh, at least this first bus stop. Should be good, I think. <laughs> we shall see though. Um, but yeah, I'm just gonna turn everything off. And we shall put the parking brake on. Open the front door. So yeah, um, but yeah, after uh, episode two uh, for here, we'll be back at Elma, Missouri for episode seven, and then uh, we'll be back at SnowRunner for a new series, and we'll be doing episodes one and two for that. Um, so yeah, and then after that, it's Big Flats, Texas for episode seven. So till then, OCD Bussin' sign out, peace out. <laughs>